Well, hello and welcome. This is Nate. I want to say thanks for clicking on the video. And I've got another one for you by a new builder. This is called the White Haven. This is a 1530 square foot home made by a company called New Vision. Now they are a new player in the market, so they're just coming out. Uh, I'm not sure how long they've been around, but to my knowledge, I'm the first one that ever gets to film their homes. That's right, you've got some exclusives. We have the metal roof, we've got the overhangs. Some of the key features they like to point out on these, you've got the LP smart panel siding, the metal roof, and all wood cabinet doors. They are made just down the road, and I believe it's pronounced Medeal, Oklahoma. So now if you're interested in this home, you can find it at Midstate Homes here in uh, Purcell, Oklahoma. And I'd uh, just like to point out Midstate Homes is uh, one of their key features. They've been around for 40 years. They cut some of their prices down by not setting up the homes in full trim so you get to save a bunch of money because you don't have to pay for somebody to come in trim it out just to put it on show and then have to tear it down again so with that said we've got our back door over there now let's uh, head on in And so as we come in, you've got this uh, arched window in your doorway there. Now, as you can tell, this is a uh, board and bat. So that will keep your price down also. Trust me, y'all ain't gonna believe the price on this home when I tell you the price. <laughs> Stick around to the end. You're gonna wanna see that. Now, as I said, these homes are not set up or trimmed out or any of that nature. So you will see the supports in the center is there is what they use for transport. But look at all those windows you've got here in your really nice size living room. You've got this really nice entertainment center built in plug in and cable hook up there. You got plug in down below. You got accent lights right above each of the columns. All your ceiling or all your ceilings are in the vents, yes. All your vents are in the ceiling. <laughs> that would be a good one. All your ceilings in your vents. It's our dining room area. Overall, we've got a really nice sized dining room. Once again, you've got four recessed lights here in your dining room area. Now in your kitchen, you can see we've got Seating for two here at the island. They've got the black Frigidaire appliances. And you've got a lot of counter space in here. Now granted, it's hard to show with it being a cloudy day out here and no lights on in the homes because they have no power. As I said, they don't set them up so that it's a way for them to save money and pass that savings on to you.
Nice stack of drawers over there. And in our island, we, what do we have? Got some more drawers. Do we have any pullouts? Nope, just standard shelving. And this is going to be your pantry area, basically. So you've got three cabinets. I'm not sure if I pointed out, this is a really wide sink. <laughs> of course, we've got our window above our sink. Back at this end, we've got our uh, guest bathroom. We've got the drawers there. Nice size counter space. Hello, Raiden. <laughs> Hopefully not blinding you with the light. Got the single piece shower tub combo. And I didn't even notice when I did my walkthrough that this door right here, utility room. So we will come back to that. Further on down the hallway, we come to this really nice desk area. Got some drawers there. Lots of space to set up and uh, do your work from home or your kids doing homework, that kind of stuff. Seems how we uh, Kind of caught a glimpse of the utility room already. We've got our furnace right there. Directly across from the furnace. How big a freezer would you like to put in there? <laughs> you could put an extra large freezer, huge chest freezer. I mean, that is a lot of space for a freezer. And we have mother nature talking to us outside. <laughs> Lots of cabinets up above here. Of course, we've got the sink. So I got to say, you know, this is a board and bat home made by a comp uh, the new manufacturer, New Vision. I got to say, I this is only the second one I've toured. I really like them. I mean... You've got a storage closet or linen closet right here in your laundry room. Just off of your guest bathroom, there is your water heater and your electrical panel. So no, your water heater is not even in a bedroom or a closet. <laughs> I mean, they've thought of it all. And into bedroom number one. I will say, because I already know the price on this, if I was in the market for a home this size and didn't mind board and bat, <laughs> I'm telling you, I would get this one. I know without being any light, having to use my light, it's hard to see some of the detail, but you can tell that there's I mean, look how tight the, the uh, joints are right there. And it's that way throughout the whole home. Everything is nice and tight. I mean, obviously they haven't done anything to the home. And that's the way the home came when they put it together. <laughs> so now let's head down here to the master bedroom.
really like the size of this bedroom. Check out how big this closet is. I mean, you've got nothing back here, but you've got this nice built-in right here. Lots of shelves. And your racks come all the way down. And you could probably even get your little shorty guy to go right there. And if that wasn't impressive enough, I'm going to skip right over those and we're going to come right over here and check out how big this tub is. Some linen cabinets. There is your not a water closet, but <laughs> there's your your uh, toilet area there. Perfect spot for a little laundry hamper and stuff like that. Hang your towels. You've got a stack of drawers right here. You know, I was trying not to blind you. That's why I didn't go directly in front of the mirrors. But we've got the dual vanities. And behind that is your shower area. Now they've got that kind of taped up. I can't get it open, so do the best I can for you here. Let's see, can I get it to go down? <laughs> I can't even see what I'm filming. <laughs> so hopefully that turned out all right for you. We do got the bench in the corner there. Got a bench over here. It's hard to see, but anyway, you shouldn't make your comments hard to see down there. So uh, let me know what you think of these guys. I said this is only the second New Vision home that I've filmed. As I said, they're a new player on the market. So far, I've been really impressed. Let me know if you guys are impressed with the homes. And I will be back with some price information here shortly. Thanks for watching. Well, I'm glad you all made it this far into the video. Appreciate you watching. So uh, we got to get you some price information on this home. Now this is in June of 2023. I am at uh, Mid-State Homes here in uh, Oak or Purcell, Oklahoma. Staying in Oklahoma City, I'm in Purcell, which is 30 miles uh, south. Anyhow, is it south? No, it's actually north. Duh. <laughs> I'm all confused. I go out of state and sometimes I don't know if I'm going north or south. <laughs> anyway. We got to get some price information on this here home. Once again, this is a new vision home, new, new builder on the market. So I don't know if that's what's keeping their prices so low. Maybe they just don't have as much overhead. I'm not sure. So price on this one, 1,580 square foot, three bedroom, two bath. This one comes in a board and bat though. So keep that in mind with this. You're looking at $120,000 as the starting price on this home. And I believe these are like the base models that they're showing here. So, because that's what they said is listed on the website is $120,000. Darn. <laughs> well, that's good. And y'all should be good with the comments down below. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.